Hi Leo, welcome to your weekly love reading, January 4th to 11th. Let's see what the cards will tell you, Leo, for this week in regards of love. What is it that you need to know? So we are starting with the core energy for the week here for you Leo all right what is this um you are over in your head you are repeating over and over again something in your head some memories with someone um you will find yourself thinking of a person here with this cassette replaying over and over again something all right has to do with someone that you hurt or they hurt you or I don't know there is um, a breakup here a separation from someone um, you feel lost you feel lost Leo and that is why you are keep going back in the past and thinking about some moments, specific moments with someone. Let's see what else. What else for this week? You are not in a good place. You are not in a good place. Uh, you don't take care of yourself. You don't, you act like like you don't know what to do uh, very focused on the past and also thinking about a reunion with someone um, you are not generous enough i don't know on what you are focused you you, you tend to have a negative thinking you try you you tend to see all the negative things uh, there is so much more and you know it but it's up to you on what you are focusing this week I see you you could be more kind more open more generous with someone with yourself here but hmm, you kind of choose to be in this negative place uh, where you are just it's like you are living in the past you are thinking, overthinking situations with different people in your life. Um, Wheel of Fortune. Something is meant to happen for you. We'll see. Let's see three cards. Is in your destiny. Maybe someone that you felt like is your destiny. You are meant to be together, but looks like there is a separation. Let's see, three cards for Leo. The judgment card. This is, um, in this week, is your wake-up call. You know, the judgment card is like that wake-up call. Wake up, Leo. See the reality. Um, sometimes this can mean a second chance. Uh, <clears throat> a second chance, um, a time uh, of transformation, of living the past, doing things different, leaving the past behind and just, you know, go with your heart, do what, um, you see, go out of your head, overthinking, eight of swords, you are stuck in your head. And I feel like you're focusing on the wrong things here. Um, you need to make a decision. <clears throat> you need to make a choice here. Because I feel like for some of you is a pattern that... The same thing that you do maybe with different people but you have the same you know um way of acting or 
the way you talk, everything that you do in a relationship, you can tend to do with everyone the same. So the results are always the same. Only right now for you is even worse because you feel lost. You feel you lost control over everything. You don't know what to do. You feel like you have no clue. You feel like um, overwhelmed about the situation. <clears throat> Let's see, um, with the judgment card, let's find out more. Communication, um, time to talk with someone, wake up, uh, see that you need to talk with someone, see that you cannot avoid this. You need to be honest here. You need to be honest with a person. Whoever this person is, um, you need to, to decide something. You need to be honest with this person. You need to be open to communication. This can be someone that um, you have a strong attraction towards. Um, yeah. You need to be open to communication. And with the judgment card is like, you know, spirit is telling you to um, just open your eyes. It's time to, to, to wake up to reality. And it's like, this is like a signal for you to see what you are doing, right? Because you are all caught up in your head, in your thoughts. And... <clears throat> And things are going nowhere for you. You will just go deeper and deeper into sadness, right? And um, depression. Uh, you feel lost and lost and lost. So, also for some of you this week, it's about seeing the value in someone. All right? Um, <clears throat> Seeing the value in someone. You may be someone that uh, you are surrounded by many people, you have a certain way of being, but uh, you are good at reading people and everything. But when it comes to a specific person here, either you ignore and you don't want to see their worth or it's time for <clears throat> judgment card again. Make a choice, look, for who you're going to give this rose. Maybe you have options. Maybe there are many other people in your life that you could give a rose. You need to choose someone. The, the judgment card is here again, Leo, telling you that it's time to see the value in someone here and take action. <clears throat> Looks like the outcome here is you may have to travel. You may have to go somewhere with the airplane, you see. Um, you may have to go towards this person that you will choose to give the ring. And look at this. There can be happiness. Whoever this person is can offer you the stability and happiness that you are um, <clears throat> wishing for so much. And you are not able to have that. You may have a home, but doesn't feel like home. And whoever this person is, look at this. It's like, can offer you that. You can make this home. You can create this happiness. <clears throat> okay. Let's see, Leo. Three more cards for you. You're praying for something, but um, <clears throat> looks like all you get is conflicts with people around you. And again, you feel lost. Uh, you feel um, you feel like everything happens to you. 
all the bad to you. No matter what you do, no matter what you say, it's never enough from people around you here and you feel lost. Something, you know, it's missing from your life this... Uh, <clears throat> Um, someone that you can trust and you know maybe for some of you uh, you know you can survive no matter what is happening in your life you know you can do it you the one way or another you find a way to resist the storm to you know just overcome all the challenges that life throw you away but no matter what by the end of the day you always feel trapped alone it's cold, you don't have that warmth, you don't have that feeling um, of appreciation and love in your life. What you want the most is this soulmate, this love, to know that you have someone there for you, that will be always there for you, no matter what's happening, no matter what storm, no matter what life throws in your way, you want this to have that support so it looks like you see this week is about you realizing that you choose to be in this bad place this negativity you choose to be a victim to your uh, life events instead of taking action and having a conversation here with someone that may be at the distance with you, with the, the airplane, this can mean distance. You may have to travel in order to give the rose to this person that your angels here are showing that it's time to wake up and to see that this might be that someone that you are looking for. But you just, you are so busy with, the, with all the storms and all the negativities that happens in your life do you ignore someone very important here so leo let me grab fast some cards for you here as an advice what else you should know for this week whoa this wanted to turn um the courage to to go with um to follow your heart all right the courage to follow your heart a lot of chemistry in between you and someone here but are you willing to make the effort this is the problem this is something that you need to think about this week all right communication communication say what you mean you may not say nothing right now and this is the cause of <clears throat> all these judgments cards coming in here telling you to wake up this is not the way you will be trapped forever into this circle of negativities if you don't take action, if you don't change your behavior. Because whatever you do is not the right thing to do right now and it's keeping you all trapped into um, sadness and that's why you feel lost and you feel like um, all by yourself in this big world. So my dear Leo, this is what I've got for you. I really hope it was helpful. Please give a like to this video. It helps me a lot and I appreciate your support here. Subscribe if you haven't done it yet, of course. Um, take care of yourself and I'll see you very soon with a new reading. Bye, Leo.